Fish. Hey guys, it's Pretty Progress 23 aka Elizabeth here. Welcome back to the Acne channel. As you can probably hear, my voice is quite nasal, so bear with me and I apologise. But today's video is going to be about how I was able to heal my skin in less than a month. And it's not just my skin that I healed, but I was able to heal my inner internal system. So stay tuned and find out how I was able to do that. Let's start at the end of April. What I did was I wanted to detox my liver because I knew that my liver wasn't in range and I needed to take milk thistle. So we all have heard so much about milk thistle, which is like a supplement that detoxifies the liver. And I was like, yeah, why don't I use that? Why don't I rely on this magical pill to help my liver out? And then what I did was I ordered it on Amazon and I took milk thistle for about two weeks. And I realized, wait, wait a minute, what is happening to my skin? I had like all these cystic bumps all over my cheeks and it was as if I was back to square one. I felt so defeated and I started researching more I'm like why does milk thistle clear up people's skin you know on as you can see on all these testimonies and then why doesn't it work for me what I learned was if you want to detox your liver you need to detox your kidneys and colon first because your body works like a system and you can't just detox one organ and hope for the best. Your body doesn't work that way. What happened was when I was taking this milk thistle, it was really harsh on my body, so much that all the toxins were kind of flushed out into my kidneys and my bloodstream and then out into my skin. And some people were saying that this milk thistle causes you to go through a purging stage where all the acne comes out. But you can avoid that if you just work on your body holistically. So make sure you detox your kidneys and your colon before you detox your liver. And that's exactly what I did to kind of heal my body in the first, you know, week of, like the end week of April. I stopped taking milk thistle and I started working on my celery juice because that cleans the digestive system and the gut. I took my probiotics. I made sure I had amazing fruits such as papaya and apple, especially apple, they're really great to clean up the colon. I recommend you to do your own research because I am in no way a dietitian, a dermatologist or any sort of like that. I'm just basing it off my personal experience and what I know. So I did that for a week and I saw like slight improvements with my skin. But the thing is, my body needed more than that. It needed a more holistic approach. So I started eating more cleanly, I started drinking more water, and I tried to sleep as early as I can. But because of my uni assignments, it just wasn't really happening. Until one day, this company called Zilch Acne was able to save my skin from further scarring. So Zilch Acne pretty much is 100% natural that are based on Chinese herbs. But before I was going to give it a go, I had to do extensive research because I've learned from my mistakes. I went onto the website, I looked at their um, ingredients, I looked at the testimonials, and it's 100% natural. It's based on roots, flowers, and herbs all concocted into one to produce these tablets. And it's an acne formula to kind of help your body decrease the inflammation, increase blood circulation within your body, and basically it decreases the heat that you have within your liver and throughout your body. So it's not just targeted at your liver, but like a more holistic approach. And what I love about Zilch Acne is that it specifically says, don't rely on these herbal pills because they won't do anything if you're gonna put junk food and you know saturated fat and, and salt in your body because that defeats the purpose of holistic healing, right? That's what I love about this brand. I love it that it truly, truly works because in less than a week, my skin has improved so much. So I'm gonna pop in a before photo. This is what it looked like. Exactly, it was really inflamed, really red and it was throbbing to the point where I needed to take like Nurofen. And then after taking these herbal medicine tablets, it made a world of a difference. I felt that my digestive system was working so much better. I feel like this wouldn't have worked if I didn't continue with my skincare routine and my diet. This is my second week and day five, I think. 
And as you can see, this is the after photo. I have a whole list of products dun, 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 that I still use that has helped me immensely. So let's start off with some of the things that I love. Okay, so the first step is cleansing. Now, when I have makeup, I used to use coconut oil. And this is my holy grail when I was much younger, when I was like about 20 years old. Well, I was only like a year and a half ago. <laughs> Not much older, but yeah. Coconut oil breaks down the makeup so well. I mean, I know some people say coconut oil clogs your skin, but I don't leave it long enough on my skin for it to be clogged. I only use it as a cleanser. I never use it as a moisturizer. And it's in like, this is like the consistency, if you can see it. That's the consistency, but once it goes, I, I, I use a little spoon and I spoon it on the palm of my hand. And once it goes in the, your skin, it kind of melts because of your um, body temperature. And then I just rub it all over my face, especially when I have waterproof makeup. I do that and then I go in with my cleanser. But before I go and talk about cleansers, I also want to talk about this bad boy. This is absolutely amazing. It's the Face Halo Wipe. And all you need to do is soak it into water and you wipe away your makeup a few times and it does an amazing job. Like I'd rather use this than a baby wipe. I'd rather use this than micellar water because it's so gentle. It's eco friendly and this little thing really gets into the pores. So I really recommend the Face Halo makeup wipes. They're really great and I think I got it for 30 Australian dollars for three of these wipes that can be used for you know weeks to a month. I can't remember how often we need to change it, I need to research that. So after you cleanse with this or the coconut, I either go in with my two favourite cleansers. The Banish Starter Cleanser is absolutely amazing for the morning. I use this when I don't have makeup because it's quite gentle. It doesn't go straight through the pores. It's kind of just like a gentle cleanse on the surface. So if you have makeup residue, then it's not going to really be that effective because you need to get rid of the makeup first before you go into your cleansers anyway. That's what I personally think. Now it has all these natural ingredients. It's no sulfates, no parabens, and it's really great for sensitive skin. And it's so gentle, it doesn't dry me out. It doesn't dry my skin out, so it's absolutely recommended for the morning. Because I feel like when you wake up in the morning, you don't really want to strip your skin of all its oil. I only do that at night, and then I put on my serums at night and I sleep on it. So yeah, this is the cleanser that I use at night. This is the Acne Dot Oil Regimen Cleanser that I've been using for four, two years probably. It's cruelty free and it gets right into the skin with full makeup. So this is just the night routine that I use. I don't use this in the morning because it can be really drying. So that's why I opt for the Banish cleanser. My next step is my benzoyl peroxide. Now, some people don't react really well with benzoyl peroxide, but for my skin personally, I have made massive improvements. Okay, this little thing, I started using this two years ago and the regimen has really cleared my skin from looking like this to this. And that was like about eight weeks of a difference. So I really recommend the Acne Doc Oil Regimen for active pimples. After the Acne Doc I have two moisturizers that I recommend after, after the cleanser and after the benzoyl peroxide, the, your acne cream. What I do is at night I use the vitamin C cream because it is so hydrating that I use it at night and I love sleeping with it. So on my skin obviously, not like, yeah, I'm gonna sleep with it. <laughs> I love using the vitamin C cream at night, so this is what it looks like. Yeah, as you can see it's already half you know used. And in the morning I do the same routine, but I use my sweet almond oil. The sweet almond oil really controls my oil, like it tricks my skin in thinking, hey, there's already oil in my skin so I don't need to produce more. So I really love this and it actually smells divine, very enriching for the skin and very soothing and calming. After that, that's all I do. I either put makeup on or I don't and that's my really simple skincare routine. I also want to talk about some of my favourite mask. Some of my favourite masks is definitely the Indian Aztec clay mask. It's probably like my number one favourite mask. 
it's a deep pore cleansing clay that kind of sucks out all the gunk in your skin like you can feel your skin pulsate and I mix this with apple cider vinegar it works so much better with apple cider vinegar instead of water what this is is I use this once a week I don't use it anymore because it is very drying but it really really helps with my acne it helps with my blackheads as well and at times I mix this with the banished charcoal clay this is the banished charcoal clay as well I mix these two together as well as the apple cider vinegar and I do that once a week for my like a more of a deep cleansing mask my second favorite is the pumpkin enzyme mask which smells I can't smell it right now because my nose is blocked <laughs> which smells really great from memory and it's really great uh, this is my second bottle so far not even a bottle this what is wrong with me today what do I call this container tub yeah it's my second tub right now and I really love it for active pimples and it really helps with my hyperpigmentation because after you know going through that breakout my skin was left with a lot of purple and red markings and I use this once a week to kind of heal the hyperpigmentation of my skin and dis discoloration my skin looks much brighter and it's much smoother every time I use this so I truly 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 recommend this one you probably noticed but I have a massive massive water bottle and I always drink from this because always have water next to your bedside table or like wherever you go because it reminds you to keep hydrated it's really important especially during these winter months i don't know if it's winter there or summer it doesn't matter what season really but just drink water i know some people get really really like upset about other people recommending you to drink water for your acne and to be honest like don't get angered by it. Maybe water, drinking a lot, a lot of water doesn't clear your acne. Isn't the number one solution. But I'm telling you, it really, really helps. It's really vital for your body to stay hydrated. If it's not hydrated, you start, you know, producing more oil. You start to feel lethargic and you start to lose your energy. Okay. I also want to talk about the Banish pen. So it's absolutely amazing when it comes to scarring. With my scars, it's really deep. And the depth of my scarring causes my skin to appear really dark. And when I stamp on it, like the darkness kind of fades a little bit. In terms of the size of the pore, I haven't seen any difference yet. I'm going to be real with you. But I know that it takes time for scarring to heal. So I'm in complete no rush. And like while I still have these scars on my face, I'm learning to embrace them, I'm learning to accept them because I feel like the more you worry about your scars, the more you feel bad about your scarring, it does nothing. Like it doesn't change the fact that you have scars on your face. And I also have the Banish Oil. There you go. Insert it here. And I love this new packaging, it's completely black and white. And what it is, is made freshly in California and you can only buy it at the Banish um, online store. You can't get it anywhere else so you know that it's super authentic from that place only. And I use this right after I demo roll and then I the Banish pen. So it's really, really great for night time. Um, it can be a little thick so I don't use it in the morning, I only use it at night. But I really love how plumped my skin looks afterwards. And I think... That's all I have for today because I think my voice is giving way and I can't do any more talking. But I hope this video helped. I know that I should wait until I'm not sick anymore to do this video. But so many of you guys have been asking and I don't want you to wait any longer. So I hope this skincare routine or like for the products that I've taught, like told you about really helps you. My skin has made a world of a difference as you can see in the photos and now right now. I am so blessed to be able to share what works for me and I really hope that this video is somewhat helpful to you guys and oh I will leave the discount codes underneath this video and hopefully I see you on my social media you can find me at Peter Progress 23 on Instagram YouTube or Facebook have a wonderful day and big kisses see you later